There is always a demand of higher quality, always. We always have to improve it. But we did a lot of trials with LED in the past and we saw a couple of years ago, now there is a moment to develop a new unit, an LED unit, because that was the moment that we see it could be beneficial and have a lot of advantages. Because we knew we wanted to go back to the kind of the original platform of the LU440 and with the six arms and having that nice compact unit that customers could roll in and out, we had to start addressing issues like weight and power levels and also how we would mix infrared and LED in that particular configuration. So we had to start from scratch looking at LED fixtures, looking in the market for opportunities to work with other companies. Ultimately, we realized there was no company that was producing or providing any solution that would work for us, so we had to do it in-house ourselves. And we took the same approach to infrared, just because, again, of the geometry of the unit and making sure we had the best light uniformity, the best heat uniformity, to provide the best growth potential for customers. The balance between light and temperature is important because these are together with uh, water the most important growth factors for the plant. When you create the perfect balance between light and temperature, you create the best possible growing circumstances for the turf grass plant and thereby a very strong plant which is able to endure a match and recover afterwards. The spectrum for this fixture really came from years of research here at SGL. We've been testing LED lights on grass since around 2008, had a lot of success with that and have learned a lot uh, over the years. So we were able to take that spectrum, build it into this custom fixture because we controlled the fixture from the start to finish and really develop a product that was built specific for grass growth. So the infrared challenge that we faced with the LED 440 was really unique. Most infrared fixtures are, uh, they have what's called a Lambertian distribution. And so the, the heat comes out almost like a bubble from the fixture. And that makes it really challenging to have high uniformity of heat, which just like light with LED, light uniformity is extremely important. So is heat uniformity because you want to deliver heat to the pitch just as uniform as your light. And because of the LED 440's footprint has six arms that are about five and a half meters apart, we had these big gaps that we couldn't suspend infrared fixtures in, and so we had to find a way, a clever way, to throw the heat out into the open area, in it, but in a very, very controlled way. Uh, we looked at a whole bunch of different techniques. Nothing would answer the question for us. And so we came up with an asymmetrical infrared reflector, which pushes heat in one direction with a lot of control, and we did a very unique layout of those fixtures to give us a very, very high uniformity of heat. To control the LED 440's infrared array, we place sensors on the system that actually monitor the temperature of the grass. And from there, our control system, which was also a custom built for this unit, monitors and regulates the amount of heat delivered to the pitch so that the customer can dial in exactly what is suggested by our assist team. One of the biggest accomplishments, I think, personally, from an engineering standpoint in the LED 440 is the overall system efficiency. Being able to deliver as much light as a previous rig with a 40% energy savings is a really, really huge improvement. When you look at the weight per square meter on the pitch, we were able to actually achieve a 70% weight reduction per meter. So overall with the LED 440, we were able to achieve a lot of really monumental improvements.
the, the most important thing for us that we deliver the highest quality. And that's the reason why the LED 440 is so important for us. With the LED 440 uh, we raise the bar again. We can guarantee the energy savings, we can guarantee the quality. It will be the next step uh, for um, top quality of pitches.